Yo, yo, gang, top of the morning, man. Welcome back to Mess Free Podcast. I am the host, Carnage Slaughter. Y'all already know that. Hey, hit that like button, man. Y'all make sure y'all hit that like button right away. I'm finna give y'all an introduction so y'all will be uh, perfectly set, you know, for the topic of the day. Let's get it. Man, you bitch niggas better end your butt elevate. I need six figure money. Won't have the bucks and hella cake. Fuck boy, I've been on dummy. Shooting hella ops, make them a day. If not him, then kill his mama. Make him feel his wrath in the hell away. Hydro shots, but it's all into his chest. Watch as they swim away. I don't stop shooting till you die in your last breath, and then I skid away. This a hollow tip. Anyway, gang, what's going on, man? Top of the morning to the kings and queens out there. Hopefully, everybody is blessed. Hopefully, everybody woke up blessed, you know? Hey, look what that sign say. Yeah, no stupid people beyond this point. And that's exactly right. Um, I'd like to give a shout out to all the new subscribers. Uh, thank you, Slaughter Family, Mess Free Family. You know what I'm saying? For joining. That's what's up. Hey, I got the memberships up now, y'all. Y'all can go join if you want to. You feel me? Just go hit that membership, get that loyalty badge, and you know the rest from there. Um, at the end of the day, look, brand new start, brand new you, so own it. Um, a lot of cats don't want to own that brand new them. You know, it's scary. I know it's a scary take on, but it's okay. It's the perfect take on that you need. It's the take on that you want to take on. You know what I'm saying? A lot of y'all take on things that you're supposed to take on. And like, why not take on the brand new you? Why not when you get a start in life, you know, that's the greatest. And I think ain't nothing greater than being able to wake up in the morning and take a breath of fresh air. Now, that's one of the greatest starts alive. And... Us as human beings, when we get that chance, sometimes we take that for granted, you know. Um, I think every day that you wake up and you take a breath of fresh air, I think that's a brand new start, period. Me personally, I believe that's a brand new start. And I think you should take, you know, all the time in the world, the energy in the world to praise that brand new start and create yourself a brand new start, a brand new pattern for yourself. For say, um, a lot of people, you know, they stuck with the old starts, with the old ways. You know, you stuck in your old ways. We already know how they go. That ain't good. Usually, it ain't good when a person stuck in their old ways. That means they not, you know, ready for um, change. That means they're not ready for a new beginning, a new path. You know, a new journey. Me personally, I I don't believe I ever been stuck in my old ways. I always adapted to the new. I always adapted to the the you know the farther on journey at the end of the day i feel like um if you got a chance and god give everybody a chance every day don't get it twisted if you wake up and you got a, a chance to breathe fresh air that's another brand new star for you but the thing is what you gonna do with this start you know what i'm saying what is you gonna do different from the last time that you you know what i'm saying what you gonna do different this time that you didn't do the last time with this brand new start how is you going to take on the world this time with this brand new start? You know what I mean? Like, is you going to be able to tackle it like you post to? Is you going to be able to handle the world how you post to? You know what I'm saying? Is you going at it with your chest out, head up, chin up? Or are you going at it with your head down, feeling like a coward already? You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of y'all be feeling like that. But, gang, I'm, I'm here to tell you, you ain't a coward, my nigga. You got the power in you. It's in you. Trust me. You know, it might be circumstances and situations that have led you to believe so that you less of whatever you thought you was or, you know what I'm saying, that you ain't got no power, that you ain't got willpower. But, gang, it's all in you. So when you get this brand new start, you make sure you live like that. You make sure you take off like that and you stay motivated, too. You know what I'm saying? Not by the crowd. Motivate yourself. Don't get motivated by the crowd. You be self-motivated. I think that's the best motivation. You know what I'm saying? Um, but. A lot of folks out here, they want the crowd to motivate them, to move them, to shift them into a new gear. No, you got to shift yourself into a new gear. You got to be the shift of that gear, you know, for real. I had to do it for myself. I had to be the shift of my, you know, my new gear. I had to be that myself. Now, it was help on the way. Yeah, it's always help. I remember um, I was the person that always said, I don't need no help. Ain't nobody going to help me. I don't need a team. I'm a loner. Um, it took some time to, you know, learn that, yo, everybody need help. Everybody get some of the best help. Everybody get help, you know, and it's okay to get help. You feel me? 
definitely when they got the best intentions and the greatest intentions towards what you're trying to, you know, get done in life. It's okay to get help, gang. So me personally, from that help, when people start helping me, I start helping others. I start helping more than I was receiving help because I'm like, yo, help really works. You know what I'm saying? And if anybody knew in the world all you needed was a little help, gang, I'm sure everybody would have been helping all over the world. But let me take that back. Everybody don't think like me. You got a lot of selfish people out there. You got a lot of conniving people out there. And um, they, you know, can care less if you are helped. They can care less if you are on a path to greatness. They can care less. The only thing they care for is that you're falling, that you're failing. You know what I'm saying? That you're slipping up, that you can't get it together, that you can't get it right. That's the only thing they care for. So you got to understand that, gang. You know, so at this brand new start of yourself, you need to own that. This brand new you, own that. This brand new path you own, own that. Whether you man or female, own it. And I'm telling you, you appreciate it that much more. You love it that much more, gang. It'll mean that much more to you. To you and whoever else got the same intentions you do on what you're chasing, you know? Hey. But who am I? Anyway, I love y'all, man. Y'all make sure y'all stay safe out there, man. Make sure you show me some support, man, by hitting that like button. You feel me? Hit that subscribe button, too. It's all free. You feel me? Hit that notification bell at the top so you can be notified every time I drop new videos and new content. And share my video if you don't mind. Um, anyway, I love y'all, man. I'm out, man. Y'all stay up. Stay safe. Stay out the way, gang. Gang, 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 what's up, man? This your boy, Colonel Slaughter, man. Welcome back to the Street University. I'd like to thank all y'all who came out, you know, gave me a little bit of your time by coming to my channel, both channels, watching the video. I really appreciate y'all, man. And those of y'all that did not hit the subscribe button as you step in, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Those of y'all that did not hit that like button as you step in or step out, you feel me? Make sure you hit that like button on the way out. Make sure my views match my likes, gang. So y'all can keep me in the algorithm and keep me moving and grooving, you feel me? How y'all have been doing, man. I appreciate y'all. Y'all already know I love y'all. Without y'all, it wouldn't be a me. So, man, I'm out.